If you're getting an error message that says SIM not supported on your iPhone, it looks like this. I'm gonna walk you through some steps to definitely get that fixed. The very first thing that we will do is hop out of here and we're gonna open up the settings app on your iPhone. Once we've done that, you're gonna tap on the general option midway down. And now from here at the very top, we'll tap on about. Now, once we've done that, all we need to do is scroll down and you're looking for the carrier lock option. So tap on that. If it does say that there is a carrier lock, in my case, it's SIM locked. You unfortunately cannot have a SIM card, either a physical SIM card or an eSIM from another carrier until it is unlocked. However, if it is unlocked, let's go through the next steps. Let's go back to the very beginning of your settings here. Tap on the general option again, and you're going to scroll down to the very bottom and hit the shutdown button. It sounds simple, but you'd be surprised how many times turning your phone off and back on fixes issues. If that doesn't fix it, you're going to find the physical SIM card button. Basically, get a paper clip or something, push it in there, or SIM card ejector, push it in there, and open out that SIM card, physically remove it, clean it off, and put it back in. If any of those don't work, the next thing we're going to do is go back into your settings. Let's go back to the beginning here. We'll tap on the general option and software update. Check to see if there's a software update that will update any bugs or glitches in your SIM firmware. After we've done that, let's go back out of here again and tap on about because it could be an issue with your carrier. So let's scroll down and you'll be able to see the carrier network AT&T 64.0.1. If there is a firmware update, it'll pop up directly on this screen to update your phone to the latest carrier firmware. If any of these don't work, the last step that you can take is to go back out of here. We'll scroll to the very bottom here, tap on transfer or reset iPhone, and then tap on reset. From here, all we need to do is hit the reset network settings and enter the passcode for your phone. It will reset all those network settings, including the settings associated with your SIM card, and your SIM card should be good to go.